so uh, my background is in actually in urban geography and planning plus GIS. So what I think that the at the central point of any urban analytics should be people. So that's why in this slightly busy slide, I put people um, kind of um, in the central point. So all my studies are focused uh, from the perspective of people, and I further divided them into two scales, the macro scale and the micro scale. So at the macro scale, um, what I'm trying to do is try to look at the city or urban structure from the distribution of population perspective with a variety of different data sets. In particular, um, what we are doing is part about polycentric urban development. Um, my colleague and I, we develop a suite of work in defining, conceptualizing, contextualizing, and measuring urban um, polycentricity ma metrics from various scale. And from the empirical work that um, we had, the empirical work um, originally from Chinese city and Chinese city re region, and more recently um, that we migrate that into the United States. And more recently, we got a small part of funding from the World Bank to ask us to um, expand the framework to understand the regional cohesion in the whole of African region. Re so regarding the macro scale of research, um, basically we're trying to see that how distribution of people would affect the urban, regional, economic, social, and environmental performances and in using different metrics. At the same time, um, at the macro scale, we're trying to do is try to see the interconnection between um, the built environment, urban design, urban intervention, how does that affect people's mobility pattern, and those are those uh, a couple of examples of the data that we are using, uh, including ride sharing data from the uh, Uber. We collect over a year data in the city of Atlanta in the United States, and also the bike sharing data. And we secure the transactional level of bike sharing data in one city in the United States, and the public transport data also at another, as another data set we got at transactional level. And in one of those um, Dutch Research Council funded projects, we are trying to formulate a um, privacy preserved framework to measure and to store the production dynamic data. Lastly but not least, um, we use the photos from the Flickr and online reviews from the TripAdvisor to formulate how different interventions uh, at a space um, can facilitate or refrain people from traveling nationally or internationally. So that's all about my research. So yeah, you're welcome to contact me. So thank you.